much Honcho at this game. At all. No. I, I don't. I, I really don't. Oh my god. The game I played today was... Oh my god. Men in Black 2 Alien Escape. Why would you make a game about Men in Black? Oh my god. Um... This game sucks. No, 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 no. This game is worse. You can't even say that it sucks because it does more than suck. It sucks to the umpteenth degree. I mean, this game is an abomination of hardware. I don't know if it was put on any other system other than the PS2, but stay the hell away from it. Stay the hell away from it. Clean and simple. Oh my god. Let's just go into it. Play it. Oh my god. So, for the entirety of the game, you go around killing the aliens that were on the ship, since, for some reason, it got hit by the MacGuffin meteor and fell to Earth, for some reason. But the real evil happens after the cutscene. This loading screen is from hell. It takes way too long. I could take a shit faster than I could do this. This is just, oh my god. I can't believe that I'm still here. Like, usually for PS2 games, it's not this much of a wait. You at least have like 10 seconds of a wait for PS2 games in this era. Ah, and it's still going. This is atrocious. Ah. Finally. Okay. Um, so I go into the missions and I have a choice from two guys. I'm going to pick K and Yeah. Oh my god. Why is there another load? You could you just loaded. STOP LOADING! <sighs> At least that one was quicker. Okay, so, basically, this guy, um, named Grok, is your first suspect for giving guns to the, the aliens that have crash-landed on Earth. So, you're gonna go and talk to him about the guns. WHY DO YOU HAVE TO KEEP LOADING?! <laughs> This isn't a freaking CDI game! Or hell, PS1! You should have just taken less of a time. You just loaded two times ago. Why? Why do you even have to do this? <sighs> Please tell me you're gonna be less. Okay. So basically, this guy. Um, the guy that you choose, sorry, goes to Grok's warehouse and goes through the door. And this is what happens. Well, 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 what have we here? <laughs> uh, it's, uh, it's not what it looks like. Oh, no, don't tell me. I, just minding it for a friend, right? Uh, come on, Jay. You know how it is. Oh, I know. 
So, uh, what else are you minding around here? Uh, would you believe, uh, toasties? Okay, boys. Now, I could ask you to drop your weapons and come along quietly, but, uh, y'all don't look like the quiet type. Now we get to see the gameplay, and oh my god, this is just terrible for me. So, the X button is to shoot. I'm not even going to go into why that's so bad. Um, triangle is to switch weapons, which you will get by the power-up little thing atoms that say MIB2. Um, like that. And they power up your gun and give you other guns. So this is the tri pulse rifle thing, and yeah, that chair is your worst nightmare in this first part because it'll block your bullets. And every time you sh get shot at, your power up will be taken away from you depending on which gun you're using. So, you better you better be quick and grab that power up pack. So, you go out here blasting enemies when these guys just phase in out of nowhere and then all of a sudden after you kill a few of these guys, this purple guy, oh my god, I died. How the hell did I die? Whatever. This purple guy with a club and spikes comes in, and he's one of the hard, like, one of the hardest hard guys from part one of this, like, level. So, I'm keep on blasting that stuff, and you see that blue guy over there? Yeah, he's gonna be your worst nightmare for a while. He's gonna be your worst nightmare, because he has a shield, and he will fire on you and take away half of your health. Half of your health is no you should not I mean dear god why that's hard way too hard so I keep on shooting and I'm down to my last life they give you three lives and barely enough health so I'm just killing him with this bomb gun praying that he doesn't kill me and he freaking looks like a blast toys if he like got into the future and he's freaking doing laser hydro cannon I mean oh my god so I go back to find some health packs which are conveniently placed there and I try not to be shot at by this guy which is inevitable so, he keeps on shooting at me, I pray to god that he dies before me, and he just dies by, him, by himself, he doesn't even care, and these guys just phase in from behind you, and if you're, if you're like me, you barely have enough health, so you're gonna die, you're gonna die immediately after, like me, and then you have to go, and continue the game. Why? Oh my god. Let's just keep playing. I don't want to, but we have to. This is a piece of shit. So, I click yes, and oh my god, another loading screen! Another loading screen! Why? Why? Can it just drop you back in? Can it? Ha! Go quicker! <sighs> yeah, 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 I know how the song and dance goes. Now, let's try and do it better. Okay, shooting up these guys. Um... Killing this guy with the pistol. Trying to get a head start on this guy. Why why is it so hard to get up these stairs sometimes? That's what I have to ask. 
Oh, and also, you see that weird yellow and silver thing that says X1 above the gun? Yeah, that's a nuke button. It nukes every, em every enemy on the screen. But that won't help you if you can't even know what's in front of you. So, eventually, you're gonna use it and nothing's gonna, like, happen. Nothing's gonna be dead if you go around the corner. Something's just gonna randomly phase in. And these guys are kicking my ass. Feeling good. So I go out and try to destroy as many guys as possible. I get a power up for the triple gun, making it a little stronger, making it go a little farther. And all of a, all of a sudden, these guys just throwing hellfire on me. And I die. Beautiful. So I'm placed right where I was in the middle of the hellfire. And it, give, it gives you a few seconds to use the power up. And then all of a sudden, you'll not, you'll, once you get shot after like freaking three seconds, it goes away. And then you have to pick it up. <sighs> I hate this game so much. <sighs> so, I'm just dodging, or at least praying not to get hit, and trying to dodge. So, I try and find some health. And thank God that there are two health packs there. But I still have to destroy Cyber Blast toys. And he kills off one of my other lives, and now I'm down to zero lives. Whoopity frickin' do! So, he's just doing cyber hy hydro pumps, and I just killed him, yeah. And thankfully, that he at least gives you a little bit of health. So, I kill this guy with the bomb blaster, and try to kill these guys. <sighs> down to the last life, and down to a measly, like, one hit left mark. So I nuke the guys in front of me and go to this guy. For some reason, he does nothing. Don't know what he's supposed to do. I don't care. Because these guys come out, just barge out, and then I try to, like, stay inside of this thing, and all of them just destroy me. Oh my god. And now we have to continue. Yet again. <sighs> why, why, why is there a loaded tree? Why? Oh my god. I need a moment.
Feeling good. Feeling good. I'm down! You lousy motherfucking pieces of shit! Such a bitches! Motherfucking bullshit! This game is atrocious! It is a piece of crap! Never buy this! Never! Just go and buy the movie! Never! I gave this piece of crap! A three out of ten. This is Griffin from ABK Dragon Griffin Cat signing out. Piece of shit.